I'm just gonna be doing a replay analysis. This game was earlier today, about five hours ago. Um, now this game was like I think about well, one of my because I had my peak today. I had like sixteen ninety four. But this is like one of my sixteen sixty MMR games. I never saved a higher rank game. Now, I'm just gonna now uh, now play this one now. I should have pushed that way faster. That was just dumb, but I mean, I do it from out of position. My fault there. That kick off, I mean. Oh yeah, I can push up on this. I'm sorry if all this looks really bad. It, it just looks really bad in the replay. Could shoot that. Yeah. Let's get out of the play. I see that kid there, and I see my teammate um, rotating back, so I can just kind of push that up a little bit. Now, I wanted to try and take it out for a dribble. I kind of double committed with the teammate, my bad. Now, that 50 there, I probably should leave the player right here. I'm kind of chasing right now. That was just such a bad 50 by me. Teammate over commits, which is kind of done by him. I don't know why I even pushed up there. There's a stop player by me there. I don't really need to jump if you I like I could see that guy in the side very clearly. Now if I bump that kid out of the play, let's just teammate I want to do on situation, I'll take skull. So it turns out to not be a goal. Now I'm gonna rotate out of the play, get some boost here, right? I wanted to go for a wave dash, but then wave dash her. My bad. Now I waste all my boost to get a bump, which I should never which really I should have pushed that ball no matter what to keep pressure. I don't know, these are some stupid decisions I'm making here. Decent save, could have been demoed. So I just passed up the teammate. I should have had that goal right there, that's a big mistake for me. I mean, as you see here, I'm, I'm turning a little hard and I'm not really, I'm kind of... No, that was smart by me to push that. But I'm kind of challenging and I'm not I'm being not really confident you know what I mean I'm not rotating I'm staying I'm not really pushing back enough like I'm just staying in the play which I can run over this boost here right here I could probably take this play I don't really need to clear that now I definitely should hit that up now my teammate definitely should have went for that now I should score that too right there my bad, that's uh, just a player. The only thing I can do is trying to prove that, which it's just I've been recently drifting a lot more. I'm trying to see if I can do that more now. I should never challenge that. That's a stupid play to challenge. Now Ray passed with my teammate. I could I messed up the pass back. Now I saw my teammate rotate back so I know I can push up here. I have to wave that sir. Nice 50 out for my teammate there. Now, I don't really, I can't really beat that kid to the play, so I should say at least 40 boost for this play. Now, that kid easily ends very badly now. I don't know what my teammate's doing there. He really shouldn't push that. Now, like, I waste so much boost, but, like, I still read that. I mean, really, honestly, there, I should not have used that much boost, but I still got the goal. The guy was out of position. You know, and already I've seen a lot of rotational mistakes here, a lot of boost management mistakes, and there's you know, way too much boost. Now I should be the left side, because it's going to close the left side now. Right there, I, I'm, I should jump off and try and hit that to the left side. That's a goal. Oh, my bad. Oh, never mind. It doesn't turn out to be a goal. I saw I didn't see my teammate back there. Um, now, right there, I should keep that closer. That's kind of like one of the big things I keep on doing. And now, I, now right there, that was... I can definitely read this kid. Now this should be a goal for me, really. I accidentally backflip. I meant to jump off the wall. I'm dumb for my teammate. Now I was thinking I could grab that boost, but I saw my teammate rotate for it. I could really go for an air dribble bump there, really. I mean, I kind of got rid of it. My teammate, I jumped over that bump from my teammate. 
But she definitely was not intentional. Now my teammate kind of makes a stupid mistake there. So I think they'll all go by, but it doesn't really matter. Now that's really not threatening. I know that I'm not a pro. We're really far away, so I don't really boost that much. Also, I know my teammates are looking at the back. So I was in a fairly good position. Now right there, I should have flipped to the side instead of wasting so much boost. Because I know he doesn't have anything for a while. Now, that was a bad challenge. I need to be more middle and more center. Now, right there, that was that, that should have been a goal. This game should have, we should have lost this game, 100%. Now, right there, I probably should have beat that kid. Probably should have beat him. Now, see that guy kind of rotate away, and then I kind of, you know what I mean? And right here, I'm just using way too much boost to rotate back. That's one of my biggest problems right now, is that I'm, like, putting myself out of position and using all my boost to do so. Now, that demo was, man, now I bought my teammate. That was dumb by me. Didn't mean to bump him. I'm going to cheat up here. See that kid jump. I know that there's not really anything threatening. It doesn't really matter. I wanted to maybe get that boost. I really couldn't. But now, hopefully, my teammate scores this, and he doesn't, sadly. And that could have resulted in a goal. I was way farther up than I needed to be, and I turned way too late. Thankfully, it doesn't end out as a goal. Now, I hit that up to my teammate. Let's see if we get to the round him. Right here, I'm playing in a really good position. It's just a uh, bad reaction time right here. And I should be actually, I should be a little bit farther back. I should be behind middle. And I never should really jump for that. I was just kind of too far forward for that. Definitely my team makes a good 50 and a good recovery here. Another good read. Now, that, I don't really need to push that play, but I, I, you know what I mean, I could. Since he's playing really slow, I, I have all the time in the world to push that. Now, see if I can get boost here. Now, now right there, I should be, I should be keeping that close. I should go for a dribble play. Now here, I heard that guy, kind of just, I'm like out of position a lot of these times, really. Right here, I have all the time in the world, I knew it. I got that demo there. Hopefully just puts the kid out of position later on. Now I'm watching him, I almost missed that aerial. I really did not need to jump that aerial. Kind of panicking a lot. Right there, I really wanted to push that because my teammate was in, in no position. Now, I should have already rotated back, really. Like, right here, that should have been a goal. I should have rotated back way earlier. I don't really need to flip into that. Now, I jump for that. Just get it away so that it's not as dangerous. And my teammate makes a great read from the corner there, and we end up winning. Now, honestly, guys, I should, we should not have won that game. I did a lot of mistakes. I forced myself to have zero boost in every play, and it really just... Shows to you how many mistakes GCs still make. And, I mean, I'm not pointing out the other players' mistakes. I mean, this is purely mine. But, you know, I was pushing 1,700. I'm 1,600 right now. And you see how many mistakes I still make at GC. Like, there's so much improvement. And, really, the only thing you need to do to get high rank is just be consistent and always punish the enemies. I mean, opponents. And, you know, that's just kind of what RL is. Nothing you can do. You just gotta get better, more consistent. You don't really need all those fancy mechanics, and better show to you guys. I mean, really, we should have lost that game, but teammate carried hard.